everybody and welcome back to my channel as you guys can tell from the chat from the channel from the title we are going to be filming a prepare for vacation pack with me type of video so I'm gonna be showing you guys how I get my home basically ready for me to come back if you travel or if you've ever been on a trip before and you come back home and your your space is a little messy from rushing to get ready it's so just uh, because you're just so ready to come home and be comfortable so these are some things that I started doing so that when I get home I can just jump back into my routine as well as showing you guys how I pack my things. Yeah, if you're interested in seeing how I do all of this, then just keep on watching. We're starting off with cleaning, okay? That is the biggest, biggest tip I can give you guys. Make sure you do your dishes, okay? Because don't nobody want no net nets or no stinky house when they come home, okay? So I'm gonna just let y'all enjoy the ASMR of me cleaning up. Back to the topic of wanting to come back to a smell good home. Go through your fridge if you are going to be gone for a significant amount of time and throw out anything that is either on its way out or will expire while you are gone. You will not want to deal with it in your fridge when you come home. Taking your trash out is pretty self-explanatory. Do that. And the other suggestion I have is go ahead and wash and have fresh sheets ready for you when you come home. You will thank yourself later, trust me. Now we're moving on to the fun part, the packing, okay? For this trip, I was going on a very two, like quick little two-day trip, so we're only gonna do a carry-on case, so this should be real quick and simple, okay? I am using my, Remo my Remoa carry-on luggage. Uh, this thing fits nothing, okay? So if I can make it work, I know you can too. I like to make a list on my iPad of everything that I'm bringing, so I don't forget nothing. I still manage to forget things. However, the list makes it a little bit better, so that's definitely a tip I would suggest. We're gonna start with clothing, okay? These packing cubes, guys, these are not like any regular, regular packing cube. These are special packing cubes, okay? They shrink, they have this second zipper that literally minimizes them to nothingness. Okay, I mean, it still be a little some, some, but you feel me, and you don't have to use a vacuum or anything like that because you just never know, you know? So this is simple and easy for me. So I just fold my clothing in like normal. Um, now, as you see, I have some pretty thick clothes, so this, this packing cube is pretty stuffed, right? First zipper zips very easily. Now the second zipper is where the magic happens. Don't get me wrong, I'm gonna struggle 
a lot of it. It takes me a minute. If you have two people, it'll be much easier to zip it closed. But I was alone, so you're going to see me struggle. Like, I'm going to step on this thing to try to get it closed. Like, it's a suitcase. I'm not kidding, but it's so worth it. It decompresses the, or compresses, not decompresses. <laughs> it compresses everything so nice and tight. So you have so much more space in your luggage, especially when you're trying to pack light or save room. So I got these on Amazon. They come in a bunch of different sizes and stuff. 10 out of 10 would recommend. Of course, everything will be linked down below in my description bar. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and pack my second pack with my more intimate things like my undergarments and stuff like that. Um, and I pack it the exact same way in the packing cube compress it up and save all my space. Now, up after this, we're gonna be doing shoes and bags, like our accessories. Big tip, guys, if you have any valuables or anything that you just care a lot about, do not put it in your checked luggage. Obviously, we're just packing a carry-on here, but if you have a checked luggage, do not put your designer items, your valuables in there. You need to carry a carry-on luggage like we're doing here to take with you so that your personal items are always on you. As you can see, I'm wrapping my shoes and my bags in uh, dust bags so that the suitcase doesn't mess them up or say if I have a spill in my luggage, my items are protected for the most part. So yeah, moving on to toiletries. Now this is a big thing. This is my skincare bag. Um, I am a travel size girly. I personally love travel size products. However, I get a lot of questions about this. You do not have to have travel size products, guys. Um, your full size products, if you're going to be carrying it on your person, on your carry-on, just needs to be under 3.7 ounces. Not many products are over that. If you are going to put it in your checked luggage, it can be any size. Doesn't matter. Okay? Okay. So now you guys see this little pumpy thing? This is so perfect for like lotions or body washes, anything you want to pump. I got that on Amazon. Absolutely love it. Um, the first bag that I packed my skincare in was from B Is, and this is from Sonia Kashuk. And I just zip it up and throw it in a bag, babes. Super simple. Now we're gonna move on to makeup. This is very easy as well. I doubt you have a makeup product that is larger than 3.7 ounces, babes, so pack whatever you want. I throw it all in this bag, and then on the top part, I put my brushes. I really, really, really like this Sonia Kashuk um, like toiletry bag because of the compartments like this. It just makes it really easy for me. I know everything's dirty, but it is what it is, okay? And boom, we're ready to go. I put this in my carry-on as well, make it fit, make it work. I put my tripod in here for my content, okay? And we gonna make this thing close, okay? Sit on it. I keep telling y'all, make it fit. Trust me, it will go. Success. And baby, we is ready to go out the door, okay? Last but not least, I just have to pack my tote or my personal item, my purse, whatever you wanna call it, okay? wallet pads in case i have my period wipes just in case something get a little messy you just never know poopery because we're grown and if i need to go i'm gonna go but i'm gonna be considerate about it chapstick because the, the planes be dry hand sanitizer self-explanatory hand moisturizer because hand sanitizer be dry okay cuticle oil because i'm obsessed i have a problem i have this mask because planes be dry and i thought i would try it out Eh, didn't really like it that much this is just some blotting powder you know, perfume, cause you wanna smell good. Gum, back again to the smelling good. This is just in case, you know, you have a little lint roller, shout to go, my computer so I can work, my iPad so I can work. Now this right here, y'all, one of the best gadgets I've ever bought. It makes my wires and like chargers so organized, so nice, so I don't just have a bunch of wires hanging around in my bag. I love it. I got that on Amazon too. Amazon's the goat. And then my headphones. And that's pretty much everything that I got to pack with me, y'all. And that's it for this video. I hope y'all enjoyed this. I hope it helps you or gave you some tips or that you just enjoyed it. And I'll see y'all in my next one. Bye.